They're playing for $15,000 all up today. The winner takes home nine. And, of course, runners looking to qualify richer semi-finals and finals ahead. Well, soon, no. Thanks, uh, Kev. They're getting in behind the arm now. This is race number four. And uh, Miracle Marcus on the inside is the favourite from Harry Day. They're about to get going. Green light twiggles. We're rocking and rolling in the first of the Alabar three-year-olds. And Harry Day, Harry Day beat Miracle Marcus to the pole line. And Day is going to dictate the tempo on Harry Day. Sven Jasper began well from wider out and goes up to have a little look for the lead, which won't be available. They're being followed by Ain't No Better, Nathan Jack, three wide. And he's got to make a decision to either get going forward or go back he's going to go forward and try and find the chair which is there to on offer for him now on the marker line is miracle marcus and they're being followed by crime time further back to our mac jack and then tubby t a little break back on the field was run business run who was away well with them tonight and on his inside was buckle down buddy down the back in 30 and 3 and harry day and dennis day from goulburn lead the way at wagga wagga in the alabar breeders three-year-old challenge for the colts and geldings and this uh, horse in front by two and a half meters now holding second Ain't no better up on the outside. And they were being followed by Miracle Marcus, the well-backed favourite. Leaders back needs luck in another lap. Sven Jasper, one out and one back as they came down to get the bill. Our Mac Jack, three back along the inside, being followed by Crime Time. Buckle down, Buddy Tubby T. And Run Business Run, last of all, 30.3 the first sectional, 31 and 3 the second. So at 61 and 6, Harry Day led the procession around the bottom corner. He circumnavigated and moved out to the railway side 600 to play. It's Harry Day. Harry Day to Ain't No Better. Miracle Marcus' favourite. Leaders Danger. Leaders back. They're being followed by Sven Jasper. Tubby T shushed out three and four wide and he's still holding up on the leader. Hasn't put the handlebars into the down down the back as yet. Our Mac Jack further back with crime time. Run business run. Buckle down buddy. Back straight quarter only 30 and two. They'll ramp it up in a moment and Day is still holding up. He knows his danger's on his back. Harry Day led. Ain't No Better the outside. Miracle Marcus still can't put a bid in. He wants to put his hand up and have a go but can't. And they're being followed further back then by Sven Jasper. Harry Day is still in front. Miracle Marcus can't come from his back. Harry Day's about to let go now. It's all over. Harry Day won the front, won the race. Miracle Marcus is right on his back second and that's where he finishes. Third ain't no better. The first three and the first three all the way. They're being followed through by fourth. Uh, we've got a photo there between our Mac Jack, Sven Jasper and Crime Time Time. Then buckle down, buddy. Run, business run, and Tubby T was last of all. And winning the front was the key to winning the race for Harry Day.